It's Free Talk Live, 603-283-6160. That's the call in line for you to take control of the airwaves, talk about whatever you want. 603-283-6160. I've got good news for people. Uh, I actually just added a thing to our stream deck allowing us to easily hit record and stop, start and stop recording. My plan is to record each video segment of the show mm -hmm. so that they can be uploaded individually because people have a hard time consuming three hours of content, but a show segment uploaded by itself independently, much more consumable, much more shareable, much more likely to get people's attention, I think. And, and the ease of uploading, will, it, will that make it more complicated? Um, how about, I, how about every, every hour? I'm going to set up a system that will automatically do that for me. <laughs> That's the plan anyway. Mm. And then all we have to do is hit this button and it will automatically I, be taken care of. I think we're pretty good. At, usually we try to keep things to a segment and or two or three. Sure. Uh, but usually the hours are pretty pretty separate as well. So, I mean, if you wanted to do three three segments of, of one hour each, that might work as well. Well, one hour is still a huge commitment for most people who are just browsing Facebook or whatever while they're sitting on the bathroom. In today's age, yes, it's, you know, we live in a, in a time and... Uh, well, I don't have an hour to sit and watch Free Talk Live. Most people are listening on the way to work, uh, yeah. at the gym, you know, when just driving around. I mean, I, I, I listen to a, a three hour, two three-hour podcasts uh, every week, only while I'm working. I'll actually just, I'll be holding off. I'll be sitting there sweating, wanting to, wanting to listen to see what's up. And I'm like, no, but I got work tomorrow. And that's the perfect time to listen to a three-hour long podcast. That's when it makes sense. I yeah. think I think you are misjudging the the ability of especially some of our listeners who who can just sit and just veg out. Well, I mean, there's no doubt there are people out there who can listen to a three hour show, but um, what I want to do is make Free Talk Live more accessible to people. Try it out and see how it works. And, and, exactly. And, and as long as you can you can see you'll be able to see like the downloads and the. Uh, the, uh, the actual viewership of these uh, yes. different segments, so you'll know if it uh, if it works. Right. I'm going to uh, keep them on YouTube, I think, for the time being. Are we, are we going to get back on YouTube? Yes. Uh, we are in the middle of a 14-day ban for, from YouTube <laughs> because of, quote, medical misinformation that was put out on a night with the captain, Peakless Mountaineer, and Melanie. I don't know what was said. Like I said, I don't have three hours to sit and watch three talk, Free Talk Live, so I did not watch the video did in it question. Did it have something to do with the coof? Oh, I'm sure it did. We talked, <laughs> well, but basically, com compared to the to the comments that I'm watching, listen, looking at, we're, we're, we're miss, miss uh, information in every single night. We've already done it tonight. Probably. I don't think we have tonight. I, 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 maybe it was during a break we were talking about the, the Rona. But uh, YouTube has banned us for that. Well, not banned us. They gave us a, a strike on our channel. Three of those, and they delete your channel. So Ooh. it is inevitable that we're going to hit three strikes. I, one of my channels got up to two strikes one time. We got a warning uh, back in November. Then we got a strike. Mm -hmm. I think the next strike is a 30-day ban or maybe a 60-day ban, but it's supposed to expire either tonight or tomorrow. So we should be back on YouTube tomorrow, at which point I will be uploading these clips well, and seeing how that goes. We, we are on enough other platforms that I don't think it's all that big of a deal. We except, are. Except, except the reach that we'll lose. But then people just go to DLive or they go to Twitch or we, we're on Twitch, right? What I want to see is a program specially made for us that automatically takes all of those chats because all of these live streams are getting chats and mm -hmm. we're only watching DLive and Twitch, right? We're not watching what people are saying on YouTube or Facebook. I want a single program specially made for us that monitors all those chats and puts them in one place for us along with the logo of where they came from. Yeah, I, I sometimes will see a video and I'll and I'll see the chats for the first time and this is three days later. Yeah. And someone was asking a question. It's like, I wasn't even, I wasn't even looking at that chat room. I don't know. I, I was monitoring. Well, and, we're and, streaming and, to and, like and, 12 different places. There's just no way for us to monitor all of those. We yeah. have to get them funneled into one chat window. I agree. That would be, that would be nice. Yeah, because people love interacting with us. Like someone on Twitch just said we should get on library. We are, in fact, already on library. Every episode of Free Talk Live that goes on to YouTube is automatically backed up to library. The issue is that we haven't been on YouTube for the last 13 days. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people were asking me about that. It's like, where are we? You just stopped doing the show again? No, we'll be back. We're just we're just banned at the moment. The for, ban hammer. And it's going to happen again. Like I said, the uh, YouTube, uh, the sort of Damocles is hanging over it, and it's going to happen. 
What can you do, though? You, well, I'm not going to change the way that I live. I'm not either. I mean, I'm not going to change what we say. I mean, I won't say cuss words and stuff if you don't want me to. Uh, but, you know, as far as... Well, you uh, can on free or talk live. M- misinformation. Uh, no. No, I'm going to keep on preaching the truth. Because I'm a truther. A truther. On this subject, I have something here from Fox News. Critics erupt on Fauci after he says to not eat indoors even after getting the vaccine. Now... I'm not getting the vaccine. At this point, it's kind of pointless. I just had COVID. And mm-hmm. by the time I'm susceptible to COVID again, everyone will be vaccinated. Except people like you and me, Conan, who just aren't and, going to and, get a, it. and a lot of other people. Possibly. I, do, I, I don't, I, I think I, yeah. But I'll, I work with a lot of people who are anxious to get the vaccine. Some of them are already getting it. What's weird to me is watching them ask each other, did you get Pfizer or, or Moderna? Like Or Johnson & Johnson. And by the way, if, if they were to hold a gun to my head says, you're getting a vaccine, I would get Johnson & Johnson. Yeah, I think I would too because it's the one that doesn't do gene therapy, It's, cla- right? it's the classic, attenuated, uh, old school style vaccine. Yeah, I'm not opposed to that. I mean, that's the, time-tested, mother-approved, right? By the, by the way, uh, our, um, our governor, I just saw a, a stupid video of him basically driving down the streets. It was like a, it was like a, it was like a parade at, at his vaccine uh, – he was going. He was. Well, going, he is overweight. He well. He got the Johnson and Johnson, and and I and I have feelings about where he really stands in the world. You know what he's really up to. I think he's. I think he's a lower elite, and he he he. I think he knows something. Yeah, but uh, and, I tend to think you're correct. I mean, I know he enjoys having the power that he's got. Oh, he On loves Facebook. It. He was just recently commenting in that thread that you were talking about regarding the Free State Project. Someone took a screenshot of it where he was saying. It takes these guys months to put together a hot dog party. Do you yep. really think I should give legislative control authority to produce to these, executive to these, orders? To these clowns? Or like, yeah. Because that's, that's, that's the point. They're supposed to take forever doing things. That keeps them from getting stuff done. Oh, that yeah. is that's, a feature, that's not the, a bug. That's the, that is the point. That's, <laughs> that's the point. But yeah, he, uh, basically for everyone uh, outside of the state, uh, our legislation, legislators are are combating. They're going, to, they're going against... Are they are trying to create legislation that will prevent what happened last year? Really, this, this guy, this governor, I, I think he administered like eighty. I think they're up to eighty executive emergency executive orders. There are a bunch of them for something that is clearly not an emergency. Correct. I mean, maybe for the two weeks, but then after that, I mean, once the once the hospitals were not overburdened, like what what the original shutdown was for. People should have been waking up to reality, but no, he's one after. The, it seems like every week he was he was calling out another one, and the, and the, and some of the legislators, it's, well, some of the right leaning legislators in uh, in control are questioning this dude's power. He's like, you you can't just keep creating creating a new order every single week. That's our job, and it's supposed to take a long time. It's supposed to be a hot dog fest. Actually, no, it's supposed to be a hot dog. Uh, so the sausage making, uh, you know, no one really, you know, understands what's taking place in the back room. And that's kind of the point. Yeah. Uh, it's supposed to take a long time. We're supposed to fight. We're supposed to bicker. We're supposed to, you know, talk to research, you know, people of research who have, who have been there, done that. And no, you just, it, it, it's not up to the king. We're not supposed to have a damn king. It should not be up to his excellency, Governor Sununu. That is absolutely sure. It's, it's frustrating watching him just extend these executive orders, extend the, quote, state of emergency week after week after week, because there's like a three-week limit on a state of emergency in mm-hmm. New Hampshire. Yeah, That's there for a reason. But what does that three-week limit matter if all he has to do is create a new executive order extending the state of emergency? Yeah, it's silly. It's completely pointless. It's just like the U.S. debt ceiling. You know, it's there. Sure, it exists, but they're just going to raise, raise it, it again. So why is it even there? Can we drop the pretense? It's it's to give us slaves hope. Yep. It's like in three weeks he's gonna he's gonna lift the boot. He's gonna lift the hammer and he's gonna release us back into the wild. Oh, praise excellence, Cisa Nunu. Three weeks comes. Oh, he extended another three weeks. Well, we can last it. We can we can do it. Is spreading the message of liberty, cryptocurrency, and peace around the globe worth $2 per month to you? As you may already know, in addition to our internet feed, LRN.FM broadcasts on free-to-air